hi everybody thank you for watching here is my CVS haul for today so there are a lot of deals I will show you each deal the breakdown and then basically how much I paid on each of my cards so I do have multiple cards and most of these deals I have duplicated just slightly different depending on the CRTs I had so the first deal I did was on the Shaw deodorant so it's in the ad they are $2.50 each, and when you buy one, you get a $1 extra buck. We do have $1.50 coupons, so you can get the Shore, you can get the Brute. So I got the Shore, I got one on each card. Also on my card, I had $1 CRTs for deodorant. So basically, after the coupon and the CRT, I paid nothing and I got a dollar back. So each of those were going to be a $1 money maker with that CRT. The next deal I did was on the Soft Soap, so it's in the front of the ad. Basically, it is $1.99. Everybody's getting a $1 instant coupon. So just by getting that instant coupon, you can pay $0.99 cents each. I was able to stack it with manufacturer coupons and a, an extra CRT. So with what I did was I purchased two of the soft soap. They are $1.99 each. I had $0.50 cent coupons from the soft soap website. I also had a $1 of two soft soap to CRT and then the $1 instant. So I ended up paying $0.98 cents or 49 cents each for that so I did that same deal on two of my cards and then my other card I purchased three of them because I had an extra $1.50 off six any body wash bar hand soap and everything like that so I was able to utilize that so in the end for three of them it cost me 97 cents or 32 cents each so there's, there's six there I actually purchased seven one of them I think is in the car still the other deal I did was on the PNG deal so I got a Tide Head and Shoulders and the Herbal Essence. So this is the cash card deal at the front of the ad. So it is spend 30 and get a $10 cash card. So I purchased one Tide. I purchased two of the Head and Shoulders and two of the Herbal Essence to get to my $30. So the way it worked out, two Herbal Essence are $12, two Head and Shoulders are $12, and the Tide is $5.94. Altogether, it comes to $29.94. CVS has that 98% rule, so even if you get within 98% of the total, you will still get that extra buck or the cash card. I had the $2 coupon for the Tide from the PNG. My CVS allows me to use expired manufacturer coupons, so I use the $3 manufacturer coupon for the Head and Shoulders and then $3 for the Herbal Essence. Also, we have some loads of cards that came off on top of that, so I will show you on my receipt. I also had a 3 off of any head and shoulders and then a 4 off of 18. So I paid $8.94. I got the $10 cash card back. So it worked out to be a $1.06 money maker. So I will show you on my receipt. So if you see here, I got two of the herbal essence, two of the head and shoulders, and one of the tide. There are all my coupons. There are the two loads of cards that came off. So I rolled $8 in extra bucks, I paid $0.94 cents and, and then at the end I got the coupon to get my cash card. On my other card I got the same two Herbal Essence, two Head and Shoulders and two Tide. With this one I had a 3 off of any Head and Shoulders and then a 3 off of any Herbal Essence. So I paid $9.94 and I got the $10 back. And then on this other card, slightly different. So it all depends on the CRTZ that you have. I had a three of 10 herbal essence and then a four of eight hair care. So this one I paid $8.94 and I got the $10 back. So it worked to be a $1.06 money maker. So basically between all of my cards, I got three tied. I got six head and shoulders and six herbal essence. The other deal I did was on the CoverGirl. So the CoverGirl, it's at the back of the ad. So they uh, spend $15 and get a $10 extra buck. You could do that deal once. So what I did was I purchased three of the eyebrow pencils. So three of them comes to $14.97. I used three of the $3 coupons from the 1021 Smart Source. I also had a three of 15 in a CoverGirl CRT. Also a three of 12 in a cosmetic. So we're going to be a three cent overage. I got the eight dollars back, so we're going to be an eight dollar and three cent money maker for that one. On my other card, I purchased three as well. Used three of the coupons. I had a four for fifteen, so I paid one dollar and ninety seven cents. I got the eight dollars back, so we're going to be a six dollar and three cent money maker. And they also track for beauty, so that's a small little money maker if you have the CRTs. The other deal I did was on the Fiji water. So these are the 700 ml, they are 2 for $3 and when you purchase 2 you get a 50 cent extra buck. 
So I purchased two of them at $3. We have 50 cent coupons in the 930 smart source. So I utilized two of those. I basically paid $2, I got 50 cents back. So it worked out to be $1.50. And also, after I purchased the item, I noticed there was a 50 cent rebate on Ibotta. You could do that up to five times. So I will submit that, so I'll probably get a dollar back. So in the end, it'll work out to be 50 cents for the two of them, or 25 cents each. It's a pretty good deal there. The next deal I did was on the Maybelline. So it is buy two, get a five dollar extra buck. I purchased two of the eyeshadows. They are $3.99 at my store. So two of them comes to $7.98. I had two of the $1 coupons from the 1021 Retail Me Not. So I paid $5.98. I got the $5 back. So it worked out to be $0.98 cents or $0.49 cents each. This also attracts for beauty. And then also in this transaction, I purchased the CoverGirl. So that was a moneymaker and I paid a little bit for the Maybelline. And then the other deal I did was on the um, CVS Panty Liners. So they are buy one, get one, 50% off. They are normally $1.29. So the second one comes up as $0.64. Cents. So it all together comes to $1.93. I had a $2 off any two tampons, pads, or liners. That got adjusted down to $1.93. So basically, both of them work out to be free for that one. And then the last deal I did was on the dial. So it's the large ad, it includes all of the Purcell and then the Swatskov. So it is spend 20 and get a $7 extra buck. I purchased four of the body wash and then four of the hand soap. So the way it worked out, the body wash, they are two for seven. The hand soap is two for four. All together came to $22. I used two of the $2 off two coupons for the body wash on coupons.com. And then there's also a $1 off two for the hand soap on coupons.com. So I utilized two of those. So I got $6 off. I had a three off of 10 any dial body wash CRT and then a three off of 10 any other body wash. So I ended up paying $10. I got the $7 back. So it worked out to be $3 or 75 cents each, which is a pretty good deal there. Also, I found a few clearance items. So these zipper seals, they are priced at a dollar. They're on clearance for only 25 cents. So I found three of those. And then just for my daughter, I found this cape. So it's part of the Halloween clearance. That came up to $1.49. So I think that's everything that I got. Um, I will show you basically the breakdown on my card and then how much I paid. So on card number one, I got the Shaw deodorant. I got three of the soft soap. I did the PNG deal with the Herbal Essence, the Head and Shoulders, and the Tide. I got three CoverGirl, two Maybelline, the Fiji Water, and I was able to get two of the freezer bags. So I just used those as fillers to use my extra bucks. In the end, all these items would have cost $64.86. I paid $18.36. I got back $24.50. That's not including the $1 that I will get back on I bought it for the Fiji Water. So we're going to be $6.14. And then all these items, I had $4.77 tracking, I have $46 worth of beauty, so I will get $3 back. I got to be a $9 money maker. The other card, I got the Shaw deodorant, the soft soap, I got the PNG, and then the dial deal, as well as the liners. For four coupons, it would have cost $58.42. I paid $20.92. I got back $18, so the cost of $2.92. But I do have 18 tracking in beauty. All these items came to $24, so I will get $3 back. So it worked out to be an 8 cent money maker. And then on the last card, the same stuff the show deodorant, the soft soap, the PNG items, the cover girl. This one I got the last freezer bag and then the cape. For four coupons, it would have cost $53.13. I paid $13.63. I got back $19. Worked out to be a $5.37 money maker. All these items came to $38.97, so we'll get $3 back. We're going to be an $8.37 money maker. So for all these items for four coupons, would have cost $176.41. I paid $52.91. I got back $61.50. We're going to be an $8.59 money maker. And then all my cards are here beauty, so we'll get $9 back. So basically for all these items, we're going to be a $17.59 money maker. So a really good deal there. I will probably go back and do the Johnson deal and I have a few other CRTs. So there's a few other deals I will probably do later in the week. 
but if you can do some of these seals, it will be good, especially with the head and shoulders and the herbal essence. So with those digital coupons coming off with the manufactured coupon. Also on these head and shoulders, I did notice some of them had these $2 peelies. Those peelies, the expiry date is 11 24 So if you're able to find some of those, you could probably use those as well. I don't know if the $3 off to digital coupon will come off if you use two of those peelies, but it doesn't hurt to try. But those are really good deal because my CVS allows me to use expired coupons and then it's stacked with my, the CRTs and also the digital coupons. And then also those dials, so do go onto coupons.com and print off those coupons. And then also the soft soap. So all of my cards got that $1 off two that I could stack with the $1 instant and then also go onto their website to get that 50 cent coupon. So yeah, here is my CVS haul for today. Thank you for joining me.